up, everybody? Cheers. And welcome back to Rocco's Kitchen. Tonight, we're making a very simple appetizer, olive tapenade. Like most Italian food, very few simple ingredients, but good ingredients, and it's going to make a delicious dish. So, before we get started, don't forget, hit that subscribe so you know when more recipes come out. And let's get right into it. For our tapenade, we're going to use two cups of Kalamata olives, about 12 basil leaves, three tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil, one cup of Parmigiano Reggiano, four cloves of garlic, and one lemon. And then we're going to serve that with some crusty bread. So I'm going to grab my food processor and start cooking. So this is so easy. All we're going to do is go into our RoboCoop with our olives. basil, garlic, cheese, our extra virgin olive oil. Now we're going to Cut our lemon in half. Squeeze that in. Just squeeze it over my fingers so I can catch any seeds that might fall out. You could use a strainer as well, but this works. Use what you got. I got hands. Okay, caught that seed. Works just fine. We just shot a little lemon juice on the floor. That's probably good for the wood floors. Okay. Now we're just going to blend it up. Just throw that top lid on there. Take it off and work anything on the sides down, the spatula. And we'll give her one more spin. And that's it. Let's taste it. Beautiful. So now we'll cut some bread up to serve with. We're ready to go. All I do is take a couple slices of bread, cut it in some triangles. We got our top and nod. And look at that. You got yourself a nice, beautiful appetizer. And it takes about five minutes. That's all there is to it. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed. Super fast, simple dish, and it's very versatile. You can serve it as a dip like this for parties or whatever. I also like to use it for spreads for sandwiches. I like to put a layer of it over the top of some fish before I bake it. It's great stuff. Anyways, you guys have a good night. I'll see you next time on Rocco's Kitchen.